Tonight with the dark side of hosting a big event like the Super Bowl, the lure of sex traffickers, people using money, greed and lust to prey on the vulnerable and investigators say it's already happening. Yes, two arrests in a case that originated more than a thousand miles away. Authorities say the pair now charged lured a woman to Houston from Phoenix. Channel 2 investigator Robert Arnold joins us live with how HPD got this on their radar. Robert. A tip from out of state is what led Houston police to this motel early Saturday. What they found was a woman who was beaten and claiming she was forced into prostitution. Two men were arrested, but those arrests were far from the only ones from this weekend. Hi, I'm Robert Arnold with Channel 2. Employees with the Baron Inn off West 34th Street were less than thrilled to see our camera. I will not give you for me Santa. Okay, um, permission to what? I haven't even asked any questions. Early Saturday, Houston police arrested Delaney Malvo and Doran Gillespie at this motel. Both are accused of luring a 39-year-old woman from Phoenix to Houston with the promise of legitimate work. Police say the pair then forced her to work as a prostitute. But the defendant would make her and the other female undress, and they would have the other female assault the complainant with closed fists. They compelled her to ingest narcotics, cocaine and methamphetamine. Police say the woman was able to secretly text her ex-husband to say where she was being held. He then called the human trafficking hotline, which called HPD. Officers immediately went to this motel. Before they could even knock on the door, they were coming out, and so the door was open, and they were able to see what was going on. But these weren't the only arrests from the weekend. Elizabeth Dees and Isaura Ortega were arrested in an unrelated sting. Police say Dees, on the left, was offering sex for money on the internet and Ortega was there to collect. Ortega is somebody that would accompany her as she was to give the money to Ortega. Police say the women's pimp was also arrested. While Houston is no stranger to human trafficking and prostitution, police are out in force right now cracking down. Those that are wanting to traffic women and, and children are hitting Houston for, for Super Bowl week. And Harris County criminal court records show that over the last seven days, several people have been arrested for compelling prostitution, promoting prostitution, and trafficking. Too many to name here. As for Malvo and Gillespie, they were given fifty and one hundred and ten thousand dollar bonds, and a judge ordered if they do post that bond, then they have to wear GPS ankle monitoring bracelets until their case is over. Reporting live from Northwest Houston, Robert Arnold, KPRC Channel Two News.